Welcome to PyCo Tutorial. In this video, we will demonstrate how to use the PyCo Toolbox in AllPlan. The support chapter in the palette contains a tutorial video and suggestion box. Below that, there are three placement options, manual or single placement, group placement, and automatic placement. First, let's explore manual placement. Here we have layout and column shoes. For the layout, you can select items such as column shoes and anchor bolts. You can also choose the reference point, central or corner. base angles, and rotation. Next is group placement. Here you can select a layout for 4, 8 or N items. Similar to manual placement, you can select items, base angles, rotate, offset and column size. You can also input the distance from the edge of the column in column shoe setting. The last type of placement is automatic placement. It includes load favorites, layout, column shoe setting, and anchor bolt setting. In the base column setting page, there are two chapters, workflow and grouting. For workflow, select a column first, then select a foundation. Shoes and bolts will be automatically generated with correct level of anchor bolt displayed in front view elevation. We have the grouting height based on Picos catalog and concrete grades, while the properties are detected and shown in the palette. Finally, use my favorites page to load favorites by typing your favorite setting name with description. A window will pop up to inform that your favorite has been saved. You can then go back to the shoes and bolts page. Choose my favorites to load all the information for use. Let's move forward to attributes, where we have general 3D object and IFC attributes. For example, changing the code text from 15220 to 15221 will update the attribute in all plan accordingly. Next is representation page where you can select layer, pen and line. while section allows you to create and place section with one click generating a section. With heading scale and dimension. Thank you for watching.